Well, I hope they do a lot better than this generation, I'll be honest with you, and I think they will. Um, my, uh, again, my, my biggest worry is they don't know the Bible. And this is, you know, when I was a kid, your, your favourite possession, you know, when I was at this Christian community, we had to have my own Bible. I carry it everywhere with me. It was very, very special. When I first really gave my life back to the Lord when I was 20 or so, again, the Bible, I carried it everywhere. It was so special. But nowadays, they're not even encouraged to carry a Bible with them. I know you get on an iPhone, you could do all these things nowadays, but even that's not the same. There's something about having a book in your hand and reading it. And my big fear is they, they don't really know what they believe or who they believe in. And the problem is then when the pressures of life hit them, they don't know how to react and respond because we haven't taught them. And my, my, my whole vision is to see this younger generation really trained and grounded in God's word and, uh, you know, really trained and know scripture and know who they believe in. So whoever comes against them and might go against them with their opinion and go against them with their faith, they know where they stand. They're solid, they're on solid rock. Part of that job is for the parents to do, of course, not just the churches. And the parents must take their responsibility and train their child up in the way they should go. Uh, but so often I think parents just leave it to churches. Oh, no, they get it on Sunday morning. But Sunday morning, I mean, what can you, not being funny, but what can you do in say 45 minutes or an hour out of all the week, when they're going to spend so many hours with secular education, but Christian education, they're going to get 45 minutes if they're lucky. And I think we really need to be really training our children in the Word of God, and then we're going to see them go over that. My prayer is the next generation do get to grips with Scripture, do get to grips with knowing their faith, and then we see them being mightily used. Because they can do the acts, they can do the healings, they can do the miracles, but somehow they need the, the grounding in as well.